In a televised speech on Wednesday, Secretary General of Hezbollah Said Hassan Nasrallah outlined the Lebanese resistance movement's stance on a number of issues in the Middle East. Said Hassan Nasrallah explained how the U.S. and Israel's actions in the region could have an impact on Lebanon. Through the deal out of century, America is trying to strengthen Israel. So can we say we have nothing to do with the deal out of century? As we enter an era of a struggle for oil and gas and water, is it to the benefit of all Lebanese to have as their neighbor a strong and greedy Israel? Another question is, had Daesh and Al-Nusra taken control of Syria, what would have been the destiny of Lebanon, Jordan and Iraq? Can we say this is an internal Syrian affair? The Hezbollah chief also accused the U.S. of prolonging the life of Daesh terrorists in order to bring back American forces to the Middle East. America wants to use Daesh as a pretext to bring back its troops to Iraq. Therefore, the U.S. government is prolonging the life of Daesh and other terrorist groups in the Middle East. The U.S. is also preventing the battle against terrorism in the region. Said Hassan Nasrallah also said Washington's anti-Hezbollah policies are aimed at safeguarding the interests of Israel. This is America and its policies. Where it sees a resistance fighter, it enforces sanctions on him and pressures him and assassinates him. It blacklists whomever it sees as a defender of sanctities and dignities of this nation. Where is the so-called U.S. friendship towards our states when it only ensures the interests of Israel? Sayyid Nasrallah made the remarks during a ceremony marking the eve of Ashura, which is the martyrdom day of Imam Hussein, Prophet Muhammad's grandson, 680 AD. Uh, what happened in Ashura helped the resistance to face Israel and ISIS and let them win the, you know, win the fights and be the end victory, of course. For Lebanese Muslims, participation in the Muharram morning processions is a way to hold dear the memory of the grandson of Prophet Muhammad, who is a symbol of resistance against oppression, and to remember the sacrifices he made in the Battle of Karbala. Maryam Saleh, Press TV, Beirut.